What is going on, everybody? Welcome back to Phones and Drones. We discussed it. It's finally in house. Samsung's newest Galaxy Z Fold 3. And uh, I am super excited to actually get to use this baby. So, first things first, if you guys are familiar with last year's model and everything of the prior folds, you'd know this box is night and day smaller than that prior generation fold. And I actually have the box right here. Let me grab it for us. And, uh, yeah. Big, big difference for what they're aiming at here. Much more, I guess you can say, environmentally friendly. But, yeah. Big difference in the Z Fold 2 marketing material as opposed to the Z Fold 3. A couple different reasons for that. The first being that this does not include a charger in the box. You're going to hear all about it. If you have a prior generation Fold or a prior generation Samsung device, don't even worry about it. It works with all those chargers. USB Type-C is still going to be your go-to, so nothing to worry about there. Beyond that, this is the Phantom Silver color pattern, 256 gig, two different color or three different color configs, two different storage configurations. Comes with that USB-C cable we're talking about, quick start guide, and the terms and conditions. Let's cut into this baby really quick and take a look. As they've done with the prior generations, obviously it looks like it's gonna come open, and sure enough, it does. And there we go. We'll set this right to the side here for a second. And you can see simply all that's left in here is your SIM ejector tool, and what's gonna be that cable we just discussed. So your USB-C to USB-C charging cable, that's all that's included in his packaging. Very minimal, very Apple-y, so you can see what they've started now with this. So beyond that, let's take a look at the device really quick. Peel off this plastic and look at this phantom silver color and see what you really get. Okay, I actually do like that design. It hits nice in the lights, it gives it a good color pattern. What's interesting is there's no Samsung branding on the back. I did not notice that. You can obviously that new see the new camera hump as well. And the under display camera that you can see without the display on. Let's go ahead and all right. Give that first fold. Feels good. They've reaffirmed the hinge. You can see it's a little different. I actually have my prior gen flip two here or fold two I should say. And uh, this is that golden bronze color that it had prior. It looks just a little different. I'll take this case off. We'll do a whole side-by-side -side comparison in our next video, but make sure to subscribe for that. This one's all about the unboxing for the three. Power button with in-display fingerprint sensor here. Volume controls. You do actually have that cut out for that new millimeter wave antenna. SIM port. Your stereo speakers. The mics the USB Type-C connector like we said, the triple camera setup, and I do like that as opposed to the older Camera Island. This one looks a little more elegant for sure. So, that is it. Quick unboxing experience. We will get this baby turned on, powered on, and uh, we'll come right back with you. Make sure to subscribe to see those videos. We'll catch you in the next one. Peace.